I have here some flannels. This is a math set. But as you can see, you can use all kinds of things. It's got different shapes, different objects, it's got numbers. I found here another number set, which is also something very easy to get. It's just little flannel numbers, all different colors. So that's something that you can keep in mind when you go to stationery stores or school stores to find something like this, if you don't have a big math set like this. Well, I use both for variety's sake. And I'll show you a little bit of what I use it for. I ask the child to pick an object that they would like. So we go through the different objects. I use this for counting. For example, I'll put here the numbers. First we put our numbers in order. My little toddler, we start from one, and then we go to two, three, four, and five. You can go all the way to ten, and then start your tens as well. So because she's still young, we just do it till five. And I ask her to pick the shapes that she likes. So we're going to use the coconuts for now. We look at number one, say one. Let's put one coconut on our board. Next comes two. How many coconuts do we need? Two. One. Two. Let's put them down here so you can see them a little better. And on we go to three. Let's put three coconuts. One. Count with mommy. Two. Three coconuts. Ooh, who likes coconuts? Yummy, juicy coconuts. You drink the milk of the coconut and then you can eat the meat of the coconut. So as you're counting, you can talk about the coconuts, you can talk about the numbers. What else can you see four of? You look around the room. Oh look, we have four chairs around our table. That helps them to recognize the numbers and also um, counting around the room, not just on the board, but they get to actually see and feel different things and objects. So you can do it with coconuts or you can have each number be a different object, a not different object for fun. Something else that I do to reinforce the numbers is I give her another number. It's like, can you find the number four? Can you put it on top? So she can say, is it here? No, is this the same? Ooh, this is a match, so we'll put the four on top. Let's do the next one. This is number one. Can you find mommy number one? Flannels are great for kids because you don't have to worry about them getting broken or ripped or wrinkled. So I just love these, and so do the kids. This is just one little idea you can do with your little math set. This doesn't even take a set. You can just even make your own. You get large sheets of flannel and you cut them out. You use a stencil and you can cut out different shapes. You can also find different flannel shapes and objects. So have fun with your little toddler.